Okay, so let's get back with the discussion pagdating sa ating pump. So we will solve five problems na printer ko for today. Okay, these are the problems. Now, ito yung five problems. So we'll start with problem number one. So for problem number one, a fan is designed to deliver 800 cubic meter per hour with a static pressure of 5 pm of water. So, binigay na kagad yung static pressure niya. In water column nga lang, on full delivery. Now, what is the static air power in watts? So, uh, let us uh, recall yung air power. Air power ng fan. That is gamma Q H total. And since binigay naman dito static pressure lang, wala siyang binigay na for velocity, then we could say this is Hn. Okay? We will solve first for Hn. Hn. And then, kapag ganitong uri ng problem, take note, if air temperature and pressure is not given, then you could use na kagad yung constant na, ano niya, yung constant uh, density of air. What is the density of air? That is 1.2 kilogram per cubic meter. Now, ganito ang gagawin natin. Solve muna natin yung HF. Meron tayong head ng water, tapos density of water, divided by density of water. Ito, meron tayo nito, itong head of water yun, 5 cm column of water. Now, we can solve for HS. So, 5 cm, yung conversion factor niyan, 100 cm per 1 meter times density of water. So, ang gagamitin ko dito, pwede na, uh, pwede specific weight, pwede rin namang density. So, specific weight na lang. That is 9.81 kN per cubic meter. And then, we can divide this by the density of air, which is 1.2. 1.2 uh, kilogram per cubic meter. Pero, ako kasi, pag uh, nakita ko yung unit, hindi kaparehas, so ang gagamitin ko, ilagay, tanggalin ko na lang yung density ng air. So, ilagay ko lang siya as time na density of air. Yan, density of air lang. So, I can solve na HF. HS is 5, 5 times 9.81 divide by 100. So that is <clears throat> 0 0.4905. Tanggalin natin siya yung PM, PM yung meter, yung meter may be kilo newton per meter squared over ng density ng So, we have this one. So, proceed na tayo with the power of air. So, air power, pinigyan ka dyan ng Q, which is 800 cubic meter per second, uh, per hour. I multiply mo ng, uh, this is Q, gamma na lang. The gamma is, take note ha, ang gamma, Ang gamma ng air is equal to density ng air times gravity. So, uh, density ng air times gravity which is 9.81 meter per second squared. And then we will multiply this with HS. HS is 0 0.4905 kilonewton per meter squared over density ng air. So, pwede natin tong cancel out yung density ng air. Okay? Density ng air. Tapos, pwede pa natin tong isimplify. Kasi yung, kung titignan nyo, this is in cubic meter per hour. I-multiply na lang natin na conversion unit. So, for the conversion of units, per hour, 
1 hour, 3,600 seconds. Okay, ano matitira? So, meron ang cubic meter, meter. <coughs> 800 cubic meter, no? cancel to, cancel yung power, cancel ito. Okay, so, then, dito lang here. Kulang ka pa dito ng gravity. Dapat may gravity ka dito. Density of air, dapat to cubic meter. Ayun, G. Tanggal natin G. Tapos to cubic meter. Yan. So, okay na siya. So, cubic meter, cubic meter. Yung G, cancel na rin to. Cancel na rin. Okay. Tapos, ayun, ayun, nakalimutan ako dito. Yung times G. Okay na siya. So, that is <coughs> kilonewton meter, kilonewton. Ang matitira is oh, tama. Meter squared lang dapat. Tapos meter squared. Tapos yung G. <coughs> Cancel na dito. That is uh -huh. 4, 9, 5, 3, 6. Okay. Yung hour makancel. Kilo newton meter. May matitirang isang meter. Okay. Kilo newton meter per second. So, multiply na natin ito ng 800 and then divide by 360. Kaya lang, ang lalabas dyan is in kilowatts. For air power, that is in kilowatts. It's in kilowatts. Okay? Yung unit niya. 0 0.109 kilowatts. Multiply natin ang conversion factor which is uh, 1,000 watts per 1 kilo. Then, that is equal to 109 watts. Then, yung power ng fan. 